Well, two men eating at Steak and Shake this afternoon didn't know they would soon become somebody's heroes. News 18's Brittany Tyner reports two bystanders pulled a man from his vehicle after he ran in, into a pond. We saw the waves and we just took off. Patrick Gladden and another man dove into a chilly pond Monday afternoon. They did it because they saw 31-year-old Travis McCurry pull out of the Meyer parking lot onto Meyer Drive, cross the center line, and drive his Chevy Blazer into a pond off of State Road 26. Gladden said he and the other man were forced to act quickly to help McCurry. I'm just glad that the other kid and I jumped in there because no one else was because there, there were about 10 people standing around and we just took off into the water. Gladden says once the men were in the water, they were forced to act even quicker as McCurry's vehicle began to sink to the bottom. We were pulling on the windows and everything and they wouldn't break. We were, and then we were trying to break them. Uh, someone brought a tire iron to us and I swam and got it and went and broke the window and pulled them out. Once the men pulled McCurry out of the submerged vehicle, they waited on top of the blazer while emergency crews took a boat out to the middle of the pond to rescue them. Lafayette police officer Dave Hughes says it's rare to see such a heroic act by complete strangers. But he says McCurry could have been dead if it wasn't for these good Samaritans. Given my training and experience, uh, if it wasn't for those guys, uh, the guy driving the car probably wouldn't live through it. At this time, Hughes says drugs or alcohol don't seem to be factors. The crash remains under investigation. Reporting in Lafayette, Brittany Tyner, News 18. Officer Hughes believes McCurry was experiencing medical issues at the time of the crash. Hughes says McCurry was taken to IU Health Arnett. However, the Lafayette Police Department says McCurry 